what's going on guys power player here and today we are continuing to force unleash and so today we are on um episode eight and we're going to the jedi temple so we're gonna get right into this at the navi computer we got the jedi temple ready and today the boss we're going to be fighting well we're not going to fight the boss in this episode i don't think we might and we might not but this time the temple is really confusing and really hard to navigate through so i doubt we get through it in one episode so i don't think we will so this will probably be a two-part episode it it's most likely will because we can't beat Darth Phobos or whatever her name is in the same episode. It just won't work. Why was I just on camera when I did that? No. Okay, good. Yeah, okay. So, little kitties, little kitties, little kitties gonna eat by my force. And then, remember the our, um, last episode off, off cam, I decided I'd switch to the, to this, um, this suit, because I like it better, until we get the Sith robe, because I like that one the most. Which you get it in, like, right before the bar, I think. I don't know. But... Those, um, those tough guys we just faced, they are kind of annoying. Because they're really strong, and they come in groups of three or two. They're never alone. You can choke them easily if they're alone, but you have to kill the other ones first. They're kind of like musky. No, they're not really, but those laser beams are so annoying, because when they hit you, if you're jumping, you fly backwards so far. Yeah, you fly backwards anyway, but... And it's like it gives you a stun effect. Oh, and this is the Jedi Temple where you get introduced, I'm pretty sure, to the... Well, you get introduced to the Jetpack Troopers, and they are... They, they're not very fun to deal with. I mean, they have flamethrowers, they can blast you, they're really hard. And plus, they fly, so you can't, but you can get them on the ground, but they do fly, so you have to, for, you have to use, like, force lightning and force pushes to get them, to get them down toward you. When they're low on health, they come down a little bit, and that's when you can hit them with your lightsaber. Yeah, but... They laser bolts, they fire so many of them too that it does a significant amount of damage. And, and even if you're blocking, it still does damage. So that that was another force holocron you should know. And I think, yeah, here's a lightsaber crystal. Blue and crystal. it kind of change to that soon. It kind of it kind of looks purple in the recording, but yeah, it's blue. But um. So this is not the Jedi Temple where you get to see jetpack troopers, thankfully, because that would not be very fun already in the series. But you do get to, you don't get to go to another Jedi Temple. <laughs> That's what I call break a statue with a human. Totally guy in the human. So he just threw that stormtrooper or whatever it was into into that statue which broke the statue find uh, revealing some health now the next time we come to the jedi temple we actually are gon gonna fight the um d it's a rogue jedi which actually appears to be his dad so that's pretty interesting okay so before I would always spend so long on this level trying, just trying to navigate, finding, I, I always thought I had to jump over there and I could never figure out how to do it, but now I know how. I know how to do it, you just have to double jump and full stash. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I 
just gonna force push him. Into a wall. <laughs> That's what I love to do. Actually, smashing enemies into a wall is so effective. It really is. Like, so I choke him a little bit, and then I throw him into a wall. Which Kill him. Kills him. Even a full, even a full health regular stormtrooper <laughs> gets pretty killed by it. But what I like to do is I like to, um... I like lightsaber throw because it does good damage. Yeah, so, lightsaber th throw does do pretty oh, good damage. Did you see that? But yeah, it goes like right through everything and kills whatever's next, kills whatever's in its path basically. Now another secret thing is force lightning. It actually lights up the place. So, so if it's dark, you can use your force lightning to light up the place. So if it's if it's dark and you can't see any other stormtroopers or something that you're fighting, just shock them to death, and it lights up the place for you. I don't know what he just threw, but yeah, I don't either. Looked like he was trying to pick up part of the bookshelf or something. I know. I, I wasn't. So another pretty effective thing is to throw enemies into other enemies. That kills. That usually kills the weaker enemy. If it's like a regular stormtrooper, yeah, that kind of kill. That kills it. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I don't have to worry about you. And then I shall eat pudding. And then I shall get sued. For eating pudding too much. Oh, and if you didn't see our pudding video, then please check that out. And... It's a very interesting video. Leave a comment, see it, of who has the better face on the pudding video. I would really appreciate it if you uh, voted. Comment, leave a comment. <laughs> that means so much to us. So, if you like to, if you liked it, go ahead and like it. Like it, like any of our videos. If you like them, we'd really appreciate that too. Subscribe if you're new to our hit channel. That would be really appreciated. Mm -hmm. All right, and. Right now, this is probably the most confusing part of we're ever in. Yeah, it's it's a very confusing map, actually. So what you gotta do is you gotta go through here, over here. Go over here. Yeah, it's not it's not fun. Jedi temples, the the kind of the yes and no, I guess. Well, the first one is plenty easy. Right there. But the second one is super hard. You have much to learn. <laughs> and that's Darth Phobos. This is the boss we're gonna be fighting. Which I think we can start fighting her this episode, but but the, but it's gonna be really hard to beat her this episode because she is a super hard boss. Like it always takes so long to beat her, and she's in. So she'll duplicate herself and turn into Juno, your pilot, and those like fake ones of hers that you have to kill. And there's a, and she turns into Juno, your pilot. Yeah, and whispers and like makes you all and like gets inside your head. She and clouds your vision. It is seriously not. Like, she could teleport. This is not a very fun boss. And, like, she kill, she makes weak duplicates of herself that you have to kill. It takes, like, one hit to kill them. <laughs> I'm actually doing this rather fast, actually. The luck of the recording. But he actually, but she calls you stupid and insults you a crap ton. Close. 
But those combos are pretty effective. Well, the lightsaber combo? <laughs> did you see it? It did like half a mini heart. I know. Ah, I need health, I need health, I need health. Give me health. I don't let it health. kill you. No, don't let it kill you. I want health. Give me health. I think I you got health. Yeah, you got I, got, health. I got health. Okay. It was in the air. Henry, I see more health. I'll get it later. I see it. I can't Ooh, pick her maybe up. She's too strong. If if the boss is strong enough, you can't pick them up. You actually can, and but it's you, only for like a millisecond. But if and if you do, they'll come back with some kind of really strong attack and they'll hoot. So the nunchuck combos I'm really good at, but the, just the regular Wii mode, I'm not too good at. If she switches, but she tends to switch between herself and Juno, your pilot, so. It's kind of, it, it's not really confusing because you know Juno's not there. For the player, it's a lot easier than it would be if you were the actual person, but that's, that's a whole different thing. Nah, hey, you stole my health? No, no, that's my health. Give me. All right. <laughs> How did she just... Yeah, she's getting pretty low. How did I get over here? So I think it might... Our episode might be a little longer than usual, but I think Henry can finish her... Finish her before this episode's over. Awesome. It looked like she just went flailing through the air. But Henry, you really need health. I know. Okay, well, well, she's knocked back. Find health. Find health. I'm looking. I don't see any. Here, I, I gotta throw that boulder out. Ow! See me, pause. Pause. Henry, you got health. Go. Okay, good. Man, it's not much, but go. Die. You're both about to die. I don't know who's gonna die first. I hope it's stuck first. I can smell your fear. <laughs> it's such a funny line. Yes, you did. Okay, final combo. This are always kind of. I always get really intense. Okay, come on, closer. Yes. And yo, did right by health. You won. Right by health capsule. And next level, we are finally going to be going to the Fallujah. Fallujah. Fallujah is really fun for us because there's so many people and they give you a lot of force points. So we're gonna end the episode here once we see out what we once we see what we got. And well, I guess we'll end the episode here. Actually, before we end it. I want to show you guys the new attack I really wanted to show off. So now we have it on our little boy. I really have been waiting a long time for this attack. Because this is such a good attack. But it's not so good on Felucia. But 
I have to show it before we end this episode. So, 16 minutes long. Right. Sorry about the links. Okay, this is the attack. Remember this from our first boss fight? That is what I'm talking about. But anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. It means a lot to me. And thank you for watching.